purple. Purple. Can you guess one of my favorite colors? It's purple. Hey favorites, happy Monday. It is about 7 p.m. on Monday, April 11th, and I just wanted to hop on here really quickly and welcome you to this week's vlog. All right, my family's eating dinner. It's now my turn, and I ordered vegan sushi. So. I don't know how to use these. This is this is just a cucumber roll. Mm. Mm. <laughs> this is my new apple tree, a Fuji apple tree. Oops. So we're gonna take care of all of our new plants that we got. I also got hydrangeas and banana tree. Let's show you some of the new things I've gotten. And well, first I'm gonna water them and then I'm gonna show you. Okay, great. Hi. Oh, got you a little wet. Hi. I would love to show you a few of the new plants that I've gotten, keeping in mind that it's only Monday and this is not what I plan on getting for the rest of the week. So, okay. Hydrangea. Hydrangea. This is our discard pile or has been but the strawberries are growing over here as you can see they love it over here they're thriving this is my red fuji apple tree i will show it i will show you all of it once i get it put in the container it's going in I also got a blueberry bush and it will be going in a new container. We have one, two strawberry plants. This is my new banana tree. I hope you can see me. Happy Tuesday. Um, today I'm going to be working outside in the front yard because as you can see, everything's gone a little crazy. So I need to trim my bushes, trim my rose bushes, and then I need to mow the lawn for the first time this year. So let's do it together. I also need to deal with these. As you can see, some of them have died, but some are coming back. So we'll get more um, when we go get plants this week, but let's clean all that up. And we gotta clean up my front porch also, or like my front entryway. It's a little bit better. I still do need to clean up my roses and clean up the actual bed, but these are shaped up a little bit. I also think I'm gonna get more rock next time I go to the store. I'll actually probably break out the pressure washer to redo this. I still have my Mardi Gras one up. I didn't even put up an Ostara one or a bunny one or an Easter one or anything. Good morning. 
I just dropped Hades off at the vet. He's fine. He just has to get rechecked because his ears have a bacteria that we've been fighting for a little bit. Um, and so there won't be a YouTube stream today. And I'm pretty sad about it, actually, because I was looking forward to it. But maybe we can reschedule it for next week. So when you're watching this on Monday or whenever you watch it next week, it might have already happened. But hopefully I can stream next Wednesday. I have been using Wednesdays as my, like, chore days. So any doctor's appointments for me, dentist appointments for me, um, appointments for the animals, anything like that, I try and take care of on Wednesdays because we had therapy for my son on Tuesdays and Thursdays. So it just made sense for Wednesdays to be another chore day like that. Um, but that should be changing here in the next month or so. My kids will be out of school, so I kind of have a little bit more um, time to work with when it comes to like daily. So while he's at the vet, I am gonna run some errands, but the very, the most important thing for me to do today is get plants. Um, I have put it off for a very long time, for me, a long time. Um, I, last year I got plants like the second or third week of March, and it is like the third week of April now. So it's time for me to get some plants. I'm very excited. <laughs> I haven't actually plant shopped at all this year. Next week I also will have to come get some plants because I don't know if I've mentioned this yet, but my oldest daughter started an earth care club at her school, uh, the school that all of my kids currently attend. And um, it's something that she actually started two years ago just by picking up trash um, around the school. She hates when people like leave trash everywhere. So she was picking it up, created a club. And then obviously last year it was, um, you know, online school. So we didn't do it. And then this year she brought it back up again. And so they have a whole club now. And they asked for plants to revive the butterfly garden. And so if you ask me to help with a butterfly garden, I'm all over it. So next week we will come back and we will get plants for the butterfly garden at the school. And that will be really exciting. So today we're just shopping for us. Today is like national everyone go to the garden center day apparently. So I can't wait to see what we get. Let's go do it. All right, I'm gonna bring in all of the new plants I've gotten. Whoo, this is gonna be fun. Okay, first up is milkweed. Do I have any babies on here? I don't think I do. I'm gonna stand right here and just show them all. We'll cut them quickly. Oh my God, a frog! Ah! Oh my God, a toad. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Come here. Do you see him? I don't want to go closer because I don't want to like encroach his personal space. Why are you out? Hi little friend. Get some water out.
Okay. Hey y'all, happy Friday. Welcome to the weekly wrap up. I am already 15 minutes late for stream, but I wanted to make sure that I got on here really quickly and wrapped up this vlog for us. So let me hear about your week down below. I wanna hear your highs and your lows. Overall, I think I had a pretty good week. I got to do a lot of plant shopping, which always makes me really excited. And I was able to set up my worms. Um, for composting so that was very exciting although I did have um, a lot of dead worms in my second order through no fault of the company or mine or anything like it's gonna happen but I just hate the idea and I know they're like they're just worms but I just hate the idea of like them having to die I don't know that really bothers me it just kind of sucks so they are sending me new ones I should be getting those next week um, and they were wonderful about replacing them I also dealt with a lot of grief this week and I think it's because um, I was at the very end of my period and so my estrogen and my progesterone are both dropping and um, that's really all I can attribute it to and I guess Easter's coming up like holidays coming up always kind of bring a wave of grief for me I just don't think it's fair that I only got to spend 30 hours with my son and now I have to live the rest of my life without him I'm not going to cry because I'm about to get on stream. But that's where my heart is and that's where my head is. I'm feeling pretty good. We have a full moon tomorrow if you're into that kind of stuff. And I'm feeling really good. The energy is feeling good. And I was able to get my closet clean, which is something I've been putting off for so long. I mean months, maybe even a year. Um, about really, really getting in there and cleaning my closet. So I did that. And... Now, my goal is to tackle my office and that closet, and I will be doing that with you guys, so that's all I have for you. I'm sitting here so, so late for stream, but I love you, and thank you for being here with me, and thank you for sharing this life with me. I am so grateful for you, and you are wonderful. I love you very much, and I'll see you soon.
Choosing to wait. 